Today I want to show you another fabulous appliance from Gourmia. This is their smaller version ice cream maker. And the thing that's awesome about this is it has its own compressor. Uh, the last ice cream maker I owned, you had to freeze the cylinder and then you put everything in the frozen cylinder and it spun until you had ice cream. This is all in one, you don't need to do that. So up here, you will see the power, timer, and start, then start and stop. When you turn it on, it defaults to 50 minutes, which you can change this way easily. And the machine itself consists of, this is the motor for the mixer, and then it has this clear plastic lid, and there's your mixing arm, and it has this removable bowl where your ice cream will be made in, and then it's got a bowl that does not come out, as well as a rubber ring that sits in here for sealing. And also included in the package is a measuring cup and an ice cream scoop. So what I'm going to do is get my ingredients together and I will be right back. So I am back and ready to go with my ingredients. At my husband's request I am making chocolate frozen yogurt and when you buy this appliance you get the book that explains everything about it plus it includes pretty many recipes and it's all like the basic vanilla and then it lists the variations and chocolate ice cream, strawberry ice cream, there's a sorbet, chocolate frozen yogurt. Now the nice thing is there's so many ice cream recipes online if you don't like what you're seeing you can easily go online and make a recipe to suit your likes as long as you make the measurements about the same as what you would use out of the book. So anyway, we're going to make chocolate frozen yogurt and it takes 50 to 60 minutes. So first what you're going to do is you're going to turn the power on and start the machine. And there's a little, I don't know if you can see it, let me turn this. There's a little door right up here and that is where you're going to pour your ingredients in. So, <clears throat> and as easy as that, now we wait for the magic to happen. Put the little cover on and wait for the timer to count down. So I will be back in 50 to 60 minutes and show you the completed product. Well, the timer just went off on the ice cream maker, so now it's time to show you what I've made. Take myself a bowl here. And taking it apart is as easy as it was putting it together. You simply take the motor part off and whoops cover, which twists off, and then this pulls right out. Now one of the features I really like about this, it will, for the first hour, turn itself on and off. So if you leave your ice cream in there for a little while, if you're getting ready to serve it, it will not get soft again. As you can see, it's got a nice consistency. And there's a scoop of our fresh homemade chocolate frozen yogurt. I love Gourmia products. Um, no, no changing that. As you can see, it looks sleek. It's easy to clean. The parts come out easily. And I can't recommend this highly enough. I will be making ice cream all the time. Thanks for watching.